Just a tragic story. A teenager and a young girl are both in the hospital this morning. They were caught in the middle of gunfire while they were on the city's east side yesterday afternoon. And Florida Governor Rick Scott signed a new law that tightens gun laws in the state. It also allows some teachers to be armed. But first, we begin with that breaking news. Future Hall of Famer Joe Thomas is retiring from the Browns. Yep. Frank, I spoke with Trina's mother this morning, and she tells me that her daughter would have turned 47 on Wednesday. And although this will be the first time she she won't spend both her birthday and the holidays with her daughter. She was relieved to hear about the latest developments in this case. And I just want to give you a better idea of how these homes were just ripped apart. This is Brenda Murphy's kitchen sink. Those same neighbors telling me that they ran out of their homes around 1.30 this afternoon after they heard what sounded like a bomb exploding. Now I want to step aside so you can see what they saw. The home completely leveled. We're calling this the decision 3.0. This time, the king taking his talents to the city of angels once again, leaving Cleveland. And while it may seem like deja vu for many fans, this also feels a little different. No cover story, no big announcement, and no jerseys being burned. Tense moments in Columbus at Senator Rob Portman's office as Hazmat Cruz tested a package containing a white powder. Police are shifting their focus right now on those two men that they say are persons of interest in this crime. The men last seen on the same block where that shooting happened around the same time that that nine-year-old girl was shot. So I want you to please take a moment and take a good look at your screen. He's not very popular. But he was elected a senator right after that, and he's been mayor, governor, senator. It seems pretty popular to me. Well, he's not popular now. The 89-year-old was actually home when the storm hit. They say he was sitting in that comforter when high winds ripped the side of his home off. Old wood cabinetry and outdated appliances, those were some of the factors that Andre Stewart pointed out to me inside of his unit. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a winner. You might want to call your family members in Florida because someone in the Sunshine State is waking up a multi-millionaire. Endangered animal. Not, you guys, yeah. he tried to bring in Not a tiger. Not just a normal animal, right. A whole tiger. The agents discovered the Bengal tiger cub on the floor of the 18-year-old's Camaro. And then we reported last week that your gloves, your scarves, like people don't right. wash those often enough because it's nasty. Your gloves <laughs> have a bunch of germs. Next story has me screaming, where are her friends? Yeah. Where are her bridesmaids? Because new this morning, a woman headed to the chapel ends up in handcuffs instead.